Okay guys, I don't, want, I don't expect you to peel garlic every single time, so I want to show you a technique or method you can use. So you've got garlic in your fridge, ready to go when you need it. So first thing, just grab a bulb of garlic, put it on your chopping board. Okay, so that's going to separate all the cloves, and you're going to be able to get all the individual cloves, get them all. Now put them in a bowl, in a stainless steel bowl, or you can put them in a container. Now all you do, Get them all in there. Get another stainless steel container like that. Put it on top. It's almost like making a cocktail. We've all made cocktails before. All you do. Okay, so look. A lot of the skins have come off. You might still have some with the skin on, but that's going to come off a lot easier than normal. Now just take off all the skins. Pile them up. And I'm going to introduce you to a little blitzer that's going to make crushed garlic or minced garlic. Okay, so once you've peeled your garlic, there's one more thing you've got to do before you add it into a little blitzer here. And that's take off that little bit of core. Now, if you don't do this and you keep the garlic in the fridge, it might go green. Because that stem's still got some chlorophyll in there. And so it's just going to muck up the colour of your garlic. And you're going to think it might be off or whatever. So look. Just put them all into this little uh, blitzer or chopper. Now it's just a mini version of a robo coop that we have in all commercial kitchens. What you do, get the safety on. Don't put any oil or anything else in here at the moment because we want a nice coarse uh, puree or mince. We don't want uh, too puree because as soon as the garlic hits the pan, it's going to burn. So just nice and slow, couple of steps. And you can see how it's all getting nice and coarse. Make sure it's not too coarse. And that's it. Get it out. And you can put it into a bowl, container, wherever you want to store it. And mix it up with some peanut oil or some olive oil. Whichever one suits you best or whichever you've got in hand. So I've transferred it. So just a little little jar or a little, uh, little bowl. I'll put some olive oil in there. Now you just need to put a little bit of salt. That helps preserve it as well. That's your garlic ready to go. Just grab it from your fridge and put it in your everyday foods. Whether, like I said, it's a salad, uh, stir fry. You want to mix it in a marinade or a paste. You don't have to peel it. And it's ready to go.